Now, there's a lot of physical damage for the side of Gaming Gladiators. They only have the Vexana for the magic damage. Will Gaming Gladiators be able to shut down the Night Horde as we are jumping into the Land of Dawn? Yeah, it's going to be game two looking for the Night Horde. If they can have the possibility of taking this to a game three against arguably the best of North America. That's right. I mean, they've been competing on the international level all of 2023. The only team that's had a chance to really give them a hard time was the Bloodthirsty Kings. And that was back in the NACT spring season when we got to see that. But now, some early aggression oh already. Oh my god, the fast rotation by them and the cleanup was perfect there. Surprise the Sleepy. And that's a kill in the opening 30 seconds of the game. There's gonna go ahead and focus on this first hurdle. Yeah, gonna try and pull the aggro. You are seeing a little bit of a contest though. Yeah, Shark has latched onto Oh My Fall. He's not going to give him any room to breathe, which is going to allow best player. Here comes the Violet Requiem onto Shark. Sleepy finds the finishing touches in there, latches on the best player. Oh! Wrath comes down with the combination of Hoon. That's going to be all she wrote for Momoi. Yeah, you are looking at. Oh my gosh, Hoon with the double kill will find Sleepy Chicken, though. Oh my god, I was like, there's no way Chicken gets out of that scot-free. Oh my foe and Sayori gonna find the kill there as well. That's right, three to two on the scoreboard. Oh, here we go, oh my foe rushes in. Yeah, and Shark are gonna find the finishing touch. Man, Shark on this toe right now is a mess. Ooh, big Molina Blitz. Shark gonna try to get a win. Providing the support with that frighten onto Momoi. They're not going to execute. They're going to allow him to walk back out to safety. And now he'll pull the aggro for this turtle. Yeah, you can see that little bit of a conceal play comes out, latching onto Hoon, but nobody else in a great position. You do see that Molina Blitz from the backside. Ooh. Shark over there as Sleepy pours through the front, looking to put some damage on. The rest of Gaming Gladiators are trying to surround him. That's going to be all she wrote for Sleepy, but did get a kill in his name for the Night Horde. Now we're continuing on with this. Oh, my foe deep and onto Zia is going to be able to get their best player half health. Fried chicken finds of the finishing touches onto oh my foe as the rest of gaming gladiators doing a great job of zoning out the night horde not in a position to really take that fight and even though he took down hoon it didn't really phase gaming gladiators so i feel like he should have been a little bit more patient but flicker play S sleepy caught sleeping in his tower with a beautiful conceal into a flicker and way of the dragon by shark sayori oh my gosh taking a lot of a damage from that eternal guardian is not going to be able to stop the push at bottom with this guinevere who we haven't really traditionally seen picked up when it's not banned out and so far it hasn't had the Ooh. most promising win rate but away the dragon yeah, Way of the Dragon. The way Shark plays this with that flicker into the Way of the Dragon has been surprised. Oh, we do have a nice little leap into there. Sleepy looking for some damage and oh. the regen, but he's going to be taken out by Fly Chicken again. And Fly has been a monster so far. R does find a kill on Tazia. That's going to be a kill in their name, but still two down for the Night Horde as R is trying to chase down Shark. <laughs> Needs to watch out for Chicken, though. He wants him to overextend. But, um,. I think we got to change the name. I don't think we say the way of the dragon anymore. We say the way of the shark with the way he's performing <laughs> from Zia. Six turrets in favor for Gaming Gladiator so far. Full control of this game, but it can still play Night Horde trying to turn this around. Oh, yeah. Dragon is out. I'm not sure who got that purple buff, but the fight is not over. Big pop-ups land. Special oh. migration. Momoi finds a kill on to Zia and Ben Sleepy. Blair is down as well. Sleepy running for his life. Sleepy. Trying to make them eat his dust if he can get out of this. And he does get back to the side of the Night Horde. Super early, but this game's going a little bit longer. They may not be able to close it out just as fast, but it may be another early finish as you are going to see the Luminous Lord spawn in. And the aggro already being pulled, but Night Horde trying to zone in onto Shark. Not able to keep up with the mobility on this show. And that's what he provides, right? <laughs> He's very mobile, hard to catch. And uh, not really pressing to uh, something fancy. Yeah, able to clear that those minions in the mid lane kind of helped him with that defensive stance. But Shark, again, showcasing <laughs> his mastery on this show. Not worried about rushing into the format oh, team. A double oh my G god. No. Shark is just a maniac right now onto this toe. Blazing Duet dives a deep onto the enemy lines. Oh, my foe has his immortality activated while Shark puts the finishing touches on to Sleepy. And that's going to be one down for the Night Horde. 
of health as the Lord pushing down through the bottom. You can see it's still kind of forcing its way there. Flyed a chicken and the rest of gaming gladiators have spread out, waiting for this next wave to come in. As the wave crashes in, here comes Shark with another flicker play into a way of the dragon. That's going to be able to find them. Spatial migration is up, but down goes a sleepy. Oh. Here comes the appraisers of wrath, and R actually finds a kill onto Zia. It is two down for the Night Horde. I'm not sure if they're going to be able to defend this. Chicken oh, goes Jim. in with that damage and takes down R. This might be Shark. all she wrote Shark. for gaming gladiators. The rest of them trying to surround, putting the damage onto the core. They're not done with the kills just yet, and that's going to be it. A clean sweep for NA's number one team currently, Gaming Gladiators.